boys. What up, guys? This is Chivo, guys. Back here again with another achievement guide. Today, we're going to be focusing on Bouncy Bullets 2. This game was published by Rattlelack Games, and it was developed by Petite Games. This game is a super easy 15 to 20 minute completion or platinum trophy, and on top of that, it's only $4.99. Now, the game has three different difficulties. Each difficulty has 15 different levels. We don't need to complete the full game or anything like that. We just need to complete the first 10 levels on easy, the first 10 levels on medium, and then the first three levels on hard for a total of 23 levels. In this video, I'll be guiding you through all 23 levels if you're having any trouble finishing any of the levels. I'll also try my best to get some timestamps down in the pinned comment or description below. Aside from that, let's go ahead and talk about how to play the actual game. So each level has a portal at the end of it. Your objective is to make your way through the level and get to the portal at the end. There may be enemies along the way. You don't necessarily need to kill them or anything like that. You could skip them if you're able to get past them without getting shot. But, you know, you can try to shoot them along the way. We basically only have one achievement related to each type of enemy. If you press LB, it shoots your yellow bullet. And if you press RB, it shoots your pink bullet. You need to shoot the pink bullet to kill the pink enemies. And you need to shoot the yellow bullet to kill the yellow enemies. Aside from that, you're going to find black enemies. The black enemies basically need to be defeated by bullets that are bouncing off of walls or the floor. So you want to maybe shoot the ground in front of them. It will bounce up and kill the black enemy. You also want to keep an eye out for the gray one because the gray one is actually an innocent bystander. So you don't want to uh, shoot the gray one. Otherwise, you're going to uh, lose the game or lose that level and you'll have to restart at the beginning for shooting an innocent NPC. So just make sure that you kill at least one yellow enemy, one pink enemy, or as the game refers to it, a magenta enemy. And then aside from that, the black ones, again, you can kill them by bouncing the bullets off of the floor or the walls. Aside from that, each level has a collectible. It's called a golden nut. You can easily get the achievement for getting a golden nut in the first level. It's basically right at the end, right before the portal. Just make sure to pick up that one and you'll have that achievement knocked out of the way. So, quick achievement breakdown. We covered getting one collectible, golden nut, first level. Aside from that, you need to complete the first 10 levels on easy, the first 10 levels on medium, the first three levels on hard, and then you need to complete at least one level in the speedrun mode. You can easily do this on the first level. Aside from that, most of the other achievements are going to basically be unlocked along the way. For instance, uh, getting the achievements for killing each of the colored enemies. You need to kill one of the magenta enemies with your magenta bullets, one of the yellow enemies with your yellow bullets, and then one of the black enemies by bouncing a bullet off of the wall or floor. Aside from that, that covers every single achievement in this game, giving you the full 1000 gamer score or platinum trophy. Again, I'll do my best to get some timestamps down in the pinned comment or description below. Other than that, as always, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe.
right guys so we're about to complete our third level on the hardest difficulty that should be unlocking the advancing hard world achievement worth 90 gamer score aside from that we should have one final achievement or trophy left that being for completing a level in speedrun mode let's see yep right here all right so what we need to do is we need to go down to speedrun mode just go to easy and start up the first level all we have to do is simply complete this level. After we complete it, we'll unlock our final achievement for 100 gamer score, giving us the full 1,000 out of the full 1,000. There we go, nice and easy. Speedrunner achievement worth 100 gamer score. And as you can see, 1,000 G out of 1,000 G. As always, I'd like to give a huge thank you to all of my Patreon subscribers. We just hit 16 patrons. I'd like to give a special shout out to everybody in the biggest fan club, including TimG84, AOJ, Kegger101, Kana25, Michael Banksa, and Purple Rain6. As always, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe.